your self-confidence will soar. <laughs> All right, Amy, you're up. Next decision. Come on, first dance. Come on, first dance. <laughs> Invitations. Oh! <laughs> That's a good one. Hey, uh, just a suggestion. Hologram projected out of R2-D2. <laughs> Thanks for your input, but this is my decision, and I'm going to go with Old English Calligraphy on Egyptian Papyrus. <gasps> what a fun mashup. It's like the chicken and waffles of orthography. <laughs> your turn. Ring bearer! Boy, oh, I'm so glad that R2-D2 is still available. You know, this is really fun. I can't believe that people say that planning a wedding is one of the most stressful things in life. I know. You're not a day go- boy champ. Okay, let's see what we've got so far. I arrive in a little house on the prairie style horse-drawn buggy. <laughs> where you are met with an honor guard of stormtroopers. Do you think that might be jarring going from wholesome pioneers to space Nazis? I see what you're saying. So you're thinking that you should arrive in a replica of Luke Skywalker's land speeder. It's not what I'm thinking. And to save you the trouble for the future, it will never be what I'm thinking. Well, you know, if the ushers are so important to you, what if I propose a trade? Now, you may pick that, and I will decide, say, first dance. Great. Then the ushers will be my cousins dressed in frontier frock coats. Oh. And the first dance will be that we won't have one. <laughs> All right. Then our second dance will be the first dance. <laughs> Unless we have no dance at all, ha-ha. <laughs> well, if we're changing things, then instead of throwing confetti, we'll release butterflies. Airborne worms, have you lost your mind? <laughs> well, if you're going to do that, then I am changing the officiant to that husky Spider-Man that hangs out at the Chinese theater. <laughs> Fine. Wedding toasts in Latin. Great. Vows and Klingon. Then I'm changing the flower girl to a dog. And guess what? Oh, good, you're here. I've decided on our centerpieces. I just hope your family isn't allergic to asbestos. Sheldon, please stop. If we keep doing this, we're going to end up with a wedding that neither one of us will enjoy. Are you saying you don't want to get married? Oh, of course I do. But that seems to be the one thing we can agree on. You know, maybe we should just you know, get married at City Hall and forget about everything else. City Hall. Hmm. I do like metal detectors. <laughs> and the sound of permits being denied. Right. And if we're not enjoying planning this wedding, then what's the point? Well, historically, a wedding was to let other potential suitors know that we're unavailable. Yeah, but I think matching T-shirts that say hands off the merchandise accomplish the same thing. So let's pick a day and just go do it. How about tomorrow? R really? That soon? Why wait? I mean, it's not that I think we're living in sin, but I do like the idea that our next act of intimacy would be a legal requirement. Tomorrow, we'll go downtown and get married. Or we could go to Beverly Hills City Hall if you want a destination wedding. 